How to add live chat and chat board to WordPress. Easy tutorial for beginners. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm giving you a tutorial on how to add a live chat and a chat board to WordPress. So let's get started. First, what you guys need to do is you will open up your WordPress dashboard and this is where you will get. This is actually a test website that I've created for the videos and I'll show you how to add a chat boat and live chat to your WordPress website to improve your customer service. Once you get to the dashboard, you will have to scroll down to the plugins right here and click on add new. In plugins, what we're going to do is we're going to search for live chat. So you can see we have a lot of plugins available. We have one for HubSpot and it has the most active installations. If I scroll down, we have others such as live chat by formula. Then we have pro chat, live chat with messenger customer chat, better messages. Then we have Facebook chat, Crips live chat and chat both. So this is the one that I'm going to go for. It has 30,000 plus active installation and is compatible with my WordPress version. So I'm going to click on install now. Once it is installed, then we're going to click on activate. So here is our plugin. You can see install Crips on my WordPress. So that's what I'm going to do. We just need to set up our account on Crips so that we can actually create a live chat. So it's actually really easy. Just enter your first name, last name, email address. Once your account is created, then you're just going to link your WordPress to your Crisp. And that's what I'm going to do. Click on continue. All right. So here we have it. And now we can create our own live chat. So this is our Crisp. And you can see it's a really good all-in-one platform that allows us to manage our chat boat really easily and also create a live chat. So this is where you will get this is the main dashboard. Let's actually set up our live chat first. For that, go to the settings and in settings, you have to go to chat box and email setting here. So you can see chat box behavior, chat box appearance, chat box security and chat box restrictions. These are the options that will allow me to create a live chat. Now, the behavior. Click on open options and you can see show operator face in the chat boat button when a chat is going on. So this is going to be like their DP, what they have or their face. Show activity metrics in the chat box, mean time to reply. So I have enabled these options. Then we have operators can see what visitors write in real time. Then we have ask visitors for their email address. If you do not want to ask them for email, then you can just, you know, switch it off. Allow files to be uploaded from the chat box. So I'm going to allow that because sometimes we need them to upload a screenshot or anything like that. Then we have show a link to a help desk in the chat box. Show an alert. Suggest to play a wait game when operators are slow to reply. So we have all of these different options that I have enabled. Then you're going to click on the chat box appearance. And in appearance, we're going to go to the customization of the plugin. So here we can select the color for our chat. We can also select the appearance, how it's going to be looking. And what we're going to do is we're going to move on to the security check. So lock the chat box to website domain. Then we have ignore user privacy choices, chat box restrictions. So there are some restrictions that we can add. For example, show chat box only on pages, hide chat box on pages, hide chat box for countries. So we can add different pages and we can add different countries or IPs where we want to hide our chat box because it shows right here on your website. And if you want to hide it on a certain page then you can do that so this is where you will be doing all of the settings for your chat box and it's ready so if i go to the inbox now it will show me all of the different chats that are being done by my team and that are being done by the chat boat so we can assign once we get any message for example someone messaged me saying that they're having trouble with my website so i'm just going to click on this option and I will select if it's assigned to me or if it's assigned to someone else. In actions, I can add mark all messages as read or create a new conversation. So I'm going to click on create a new conversation. Enter the username right here. So we will enter username here. Then we can create an email conversation or SMS. So I'm going to select SMS. 
and then we have the phone number click on you know create and you will be able to create a new conversation if i go to the visitors right here it'll show me the live visitors then we have contacts where we can actually add contacts for our new customers of all the subscriptions that i have so it helps us get more productive and more efficient so have we have help desk right here analytics and plugins so in plugins what i can do is i can actually add a boat we have created a live chat and i can now create a boat as well because with the live chat i have to reply every time so what we can do is if you do not want to add a you know live chat to your website you can add a boat as well so just go to the plugin section right here and click on view details it is already added you can see add a boat to your customer service so it's a all-in-one customer service platform that helps us to create a live chat it is added to my wordpress website now so if i just go back to my dashboard I will be able to see my plugin and I will be able to see all of the different settings that we did for Crips. So now I can go back right here. This is my website that we connected and we can manage our account anytime we like. We can also connect our Facebook Messenger with our Crisp and we can also add our Slack, um, Discord and our Gmail. So this is actually really good. In order to add a contact, what you need to do is go right here, click on new contact. Let's say I encountered a new customer. So I'm just going to enter their name, for example, Ben, and then we have their email. Click on add contact and the contact will be added. You can see right here. Now I can live chat with them, send them a message through a website. So it's actually really easy. This is what the chat looks like and I can send them hello how may i help you this is going to be my message and you can see this is what it looks like and they will message me back and this is how i can live chat with my customers in order to improve my customer service of my website go ahead and add the crisp plugin to your wordpress website and you'll be able to live chat with your customers so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you know everything that you wanted to know and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if this tutorial was a big help to you, I tried to do everything about the topic and I hope that you understood everything and now you are good to go. And don't forget to uh, share this video with your friends and family members so they can also get the information they want to. Also, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel. The button will be given right down below go ahead and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also, hit the notification bell so every time you get notified when we post a video. So yeah, also leave a comment down below what was your favorite part and what did you learn from this video or if you have any question.